wrestlers are unique in this fact. They don't give you a script, and certainly in that day didn't give you a script. Gave you a character. Aside from the poetry, if the genius were a real person, because when you do the wrestling shows, essentially you have to be that, what kind of guy is he? Where does he go home to? What, what streets does he travel? What's well, important to him? Okay, thank you. for What a great question. Man, that was, you know, this is going to be a fantastic uh, interview. I think it is so far. Yeah, yeah. That, but that, that is a, I've never been asked that. Oh, <laughs> we're, we're historic then. <clears throat> do you remember um, Peter Sellers as Inspector Clouseau in the Pink Panther? Yes. That's the genius. That's the genius. Yes. I've got such, I'm actually quite insecure, but I make up for it with a facade of confidence and that I'm constantly making a fool of myself. And I knew that, you idiot. That was only testing you. Mm. And then that's like a one-joke movie, that same joke all the time. And um, may I say that Steve Martin also tried to do that, and I give him credit for trying, but there's only one Peter Sellers. And uh, Steve Martin is fantastic, and I think he made it his own, but the genius was Peter Sellers. So for people who don't understand that analogy, the genius is not as smart as he claims to be. No, if I were as smart as I claimed to be, I would be a baby face, and you'd have to cheer me. But to act like I was thought I was, I want to be, you know how the kid in the class that goes, oh, Mr. Carter. And then he's not really smart, but he's wanting everybody to think he is or something. Wants attention. Like, right. Mm -hmm. I wanted to be that guy. Yeah. You know, I, and I was just playing with different versions of myself. But when Hulk Hogan told me to turn up the gay, I did. Mm -hmm. And you know what? He hasn't done a thing for me in the last two decades, but I can't stop loving him for what he did once. You see what I mean? We're I don't want to be one of those guys that says, what have you done for me lately? Yeah. Because the thing is, he created the genius. I mean, I was already there, but when you step in the ring with Hulk Hogan and uh, NBC, mm. you know, that's the epitome. And then right after that, to go on Regis, you know, I've got selective amnesia. I don't want to remember some of my career. I want to just think about the, the champagne and the caviar. 